Hi guys and welcome back to my allotment. It is Thursday the 28th. I've just popped down to get some loppers out the shed so that I can take them back home so we can do a little bit of gardening at my parents' house. But let me show you this. Yay! This bit has been trimmed again. What a difference. So we're back home. I've managed to move this up to the edge of the beds just to stop anything growing up that way. And we've left it clear at the top end so we can finally make a start on our um, thingamabobberies, compost bins. So I'm just going to pick up the loppers and then I think that courgette is ready. So let's go have a look and we're going to pick the very first thing off the plot. The most exciting thing, isn't it? Look at this. This is coming out with me. <laughs> Did you do a little twist? Fabulous, and there's loads more coming. Oh, that one's nearly ready. We'll let that one fatten up, you see. Oh, right then. So I'm not sure when we'll be back. Where is it? There we are. That's doing fab as well. Nearly ready. It needs to be a bit fatter, I think. So that's everything for today. I've literally just stopped in on the way home from work to get those loppers. Um, I'll catch you all next time I'm here. Take care. Hi, guys. It is Wednesday. The third i think it is of august how are y'all doing so i've not been here for a few days we've been away and gosh so much has happened let me turn you around firstly it is bramble season i've just tasted them and they are so soft and sweet and juicy so we're going to do a lot of bramble picking now <laughs> what happens when you do not pick your courgette on time it grows into a monster is general so that is coming up today and um, everything's doing really well um so well beans are doing amazing these two have gone a bit crazy these probably need have the tips been cut out of these i maybe just do it again just to make sure because they've gone a bit bit nutty um it's just looking great and they have been taken out but yeah we'll just take some more out there we go um like literally they're going crazy it's, it's looking so so good i'm really happy i know i seem to give you a mini plot tour every time but it don't matter does it well that squash has gone crazy <laughs> corn is doing amazing pumpkin is doing great um what else have we got here so this is my pumpkin I can't remember having my nasturtiums here, but I must have done. Little weed there, let me get that devil out. Did I have my nasturtiums there? I just don't remember. Um, a few weeds. Cucumbers are doing all right, look. There's... Oh, 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 I've got a baby cucumber. Hooray. <laughs> That's amazing. Very exciting. Um, oh, this needs to come up. It's fallen off. These are growing on the ground. They need to come up. Okay, I need to get those in. All right, we'll do that in a minute. More bloody courgettes. Another one ready there. Um, the lettuce is ready to start picking. And look, my new seeds are seeding. They are growing. Hooray, hooray, hooray. And these tomatoes look a bit dodge. But then they seem to be coming back again. Like they went a bit dodgy when I put them in, but they're all right. These ones are doing okay. And we've just driven in and there's a load of wood chip that's arrived. Now we used to, um, before we got our plot, there'd be reg um, a tree surgeon that used to drop off wood chips and stuff. Anyway, there's some wood chip here. So Hubby has just gone <laughs> back to get out of his flip flops into his trainers. And we're gonna bring a load of wood chippings in. I'm going to just do these couple of paths here and just get started. So yeah, and look. Hello, beautiful zinnia. I've never grown zinnias before. Isn't it pretty? So yeah, that's where we're at. Exciting times. I've got a new hat. Um, I went to see Christina Aguilera last night. Someone's hat from way up behind me blew off. It was an outdoor stadium and um, <laughs> it landed on my lap. I'm going to bring it down next time. It is hilarious it's so appropriate that i just love it so i'll share that next time i'm here but yeah i'm gonna just crack on and get a few jobs done 
Hello lovely people, it's Thursday the 4th of August, about 20 past 7, currently 20 degrees, um, that's 20 past 7 in the evening and tonight I'm just going to do a little bit of watering because we're going to the caravan tomorrow straight from work and then we'll be back hopefully Saturday late afternoon, potentially Sunday morning, just depends, we've got a few things we need to do. Today I am armed, dressed like a ninja because last night I came down in sandals and shorts and I have been bitten so many times by the red ants so they're not getting me again. Um, it is now just courgette, bloody watch, another courgette here. So yeah, I'm just gonna do a bit of watering, just check quickly what's growing, what's doing okay, what needs attention. And that's gonna be, it's gonna be just a really super fast one tonight and then I'll be back with a bit more on the weekend. So I'll see you on Saturday or Sunday. So there's just a couple of things I wanna show you before I leave tonight, it's still Thursday. So when I planted these tomatoes in last week, I also had this one tomato, but look, there he is. Some tiny, can I, can I get this to focus? Where am I? So you've got the one big one, and then we've got one, two, three, four. So it's like a little mini vine, so that's cool. Um, I've sort of tied them up a wee bit. And then plus, I've read or saw um, about when it's been really hot, the, the beans can like drop their flowers. And I sort of, I saw that you meant to like maybe mist the flowers on an evening, which will help to set the flowers so you get your beans. So I've given them a little bit of a, a wet but there are definitely some beans coming. I saw some. Um, so I think it's just not being so hot because all these started flowering when we had that really high temperatures, like in the like 40 degrees, which is like so unusual for the UK. So um, yeah, but I have definitely got some beans coming because I saw them, but I no longer know where they are. Let me see if I can find one because it's probably not exciting to you, but it's really exciting to me. Um, anyway, you'll have to try. Oh, there we go. There's one coming here, I think. It looks like it is, and there's a few others that are just sort of about to hopefully grow. But yeah, loads and loads of like little tiny dwarf French beans are growing. So we're gonna have to have lots and lots of courgettes and lots and lots of beans, I think. Um, I've put an SOS out to my neighbors and friends and family for people who want courgettes. Obviously I took two away last night and yes, I've got another three ready today. <laughs> That's how fast they're growing and literally they are, they're just like literally gonna be, like when I come back in two days, I'm gonna probably have about another 10 courgettes, I think, but all my neighbors are wanting some, so they'll get those ones. So yeah, I'm like pretty, pretty zinnia. How gorgeous. So yeah, I'll see you at the weekend. Hey guys, it's Wednesday the 10th of August. I'm just down doing more watering. I thought I'd just show you a couple of things. So tomatoes have really perked up, looking grand. And these ones from before are doing really, really well. But look, I have got a little tomato on this plant as well. So that's good. Um, cucumber is doing really well. There's not much to tell just now. It's just watering and little updates. So. I'm not sure, I might sort of pick that at the weekend, I think. They're so bubbly, so spiky. Um, but lots more coming, which is really exciting. And that they're doing really, really well. Really well. Um, lettuce, courgettes, all doing fab. Really exciting development, the corn. I can hear pigeons, look. They're there waiting. Again, little devils. Um, the corn is starting to grow. I think these are going to be the tufts that end up pollinating, that end up making the cobs, I think. I'm not sure. And hooray! We've got some little nasturtium flowers at last. Really pretty. Um, no pumpkins yet, but it's growing really well. My beans are now doing excellent. These are starting to grow, but more excitingly, I think I've got some French beans to harvest. I just looked in here today and look, there are loads. So I'm going to pick some, I think. Look, 
that. I've got a French bean. <laughs> right, I'm gonna go pick a load and have a look through. I think I've got a lot that I didn't realize I had. So yeah, I'm gonna um, pick them and then I'll come back in a second. Well, these were a bit of a surprise. Look how many there are. That's amazing. So this is tonight's lot, some lettuce, courgette, and dwarf French beans. Hooray! Hey, it's Friday the 11th, I think, of August. And we're in the middle of a heat wave. So I'm gonna do a bit of watering. And I think this is gonna be like my final little bit of this, because all it is at the minute is watering. But I'm about to start my week's annual leave. So I'll be doing a few more things. So I'll do a separate vlog for that. But there's a few interesting things to see. Something is taking these out. It's happened a few times now, um, my labels. So yeah, I'm gonna do a bit of guesswork as to where everything is. But yeah, I think that's about right. But something's taking them out. Um, I have got a cucumber ready. I think it's ready. Um, it's a Market Mall 76. I think I'm just gonna pick it and see. More courgettes. Corn is starting to corn. <laughs> We've got these little bits here coming. The beans are doing good. Did I show you my harvest of French beans the other day? Yes, I've got some of those. I think the peas are about ready. Um, I've only got a few, <laughs> so I'm going to wait till I'm ready to eat them and then I'll pick them then. Um, and my runner beans and climbing beans are finally doing well. I've started washing the flowers on the night just to try and prevent the flowers from dropping. And so it helps to set them, I think, and then you get your beans. And now, it's working. Um, so yeah, I lost loads of flowers at the bottom without any beans. Since I've been watering them, I'm now getting beans. And yeah, they're doing really well. So I will um, round up in a minute. I'm gonna just get a harvest what I can. And um, yeah, we'll finish off. I'm gonna do my shed this week. Um, the salad leaves are doing amazing. Oh, shit. Um, so so well. They need coming out now. We need to pick them and get them used. Um, some different ones here, and then the seeds are coming on well. Not all germinating, a bit patchy, but um, things are coming through. It's just been so hot, so I'm just going to keep on watering, and then yeah, we'll just see what happens. Really, a lovely little harvest. Some. French dwarf beans, first cucumber, courgettes, and some salad greens. So guys, good night for me, and I'll see you all in my next one. Thank you so much for watching. I'd love it if you would subscribe if you haven't already. And then yeah, I'll see you all next week. Take care, happy gardening. Thanks for watching.